All right, everybody, uh, we are back. My next guest runs the only school in the world whose sole curriculum is teaching women the art of sensuality. From Mama Gina's School of Womanly Arts here in New York City, please welcome Regina Tomashauer. <laughs> I have one of those. Now, uh, <laughs> nice to have you here, by the way. Wonderful to be here. Let me qu explain quickly. Uh, a few of the women on our staff went, went to this uh, course. They did. And they said that, uh, oh, this would be a good guest. So I don't really know much about what's going on here. Clearly, I'm no expert with the ladies. <laughs> but tell us, what, what is a, a womanly art? Well, one of the lost womanly arts is the art of flirtation. Nobody flirts anymore. Right. And it's such a joy right. when you meet a woman who's just willing to flirt with you and have fun with you. How do you teach that, though? How do you teach flirting? You know, I have, I have my, my ways, my methods. Mm -hmm. I, I have an exercise that I teach my goddesses. Mm -hmm. Your goddesses are? My goddesses are the students at the School of Womanly Arts. They're okay. called sister goddesses. Sister goddesses, mm -hmm. okay. And what we do is I teach them something called beat a shot. Okay, I don't know what that, what, what, is that, what does that mean? It's French. Mm -hmm. I don't want to scare you by telling you exactly what it means, but the a, a rough equivalent would be something like um, penis and vulva. And what a woman, <laughs> and what a woman does is, um, I, I train my goddesses to sort of get a hold of their turn on dial. Like to understand that they are the ones driving the turn on dial. So let's say for example, a woman will go into a deli and she'll think... Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Why does she need to get turned on at a deli? You know, it's a great question, because most... Yes, it is. <laughs> See, most women think that when they flirt, it's like in order to get something. Right. Like to get a guy to ask her out or be interested in right, her. Right, right. But I want them to understand that turn on is just for fun. Right. It's just because it's fun to be fabulous and gorgeous and sensual. Right. So if they do it at a deli where it's like safe, the guy's behind the deli counter. <laughs> She's making his day. She's what is she doing at the deli? <laughs> and where is this deli? Because I'm going right after the show. <laughs> Gonna get a little booth in the corner and, you know. See, a woman doesn't have to do much. All she does is have to play beat a shot, which is to think pleasurable thoughts. And she can arouse herself without really doing anything. Not just arouse herself, but, you know, the guy, the deli guy. You, you can arouse the, is this a good idea to go around New York City arousing deli guys? <laughs> And just well, picture the guy like, yeah, I'll be with you in a minute. <laughs> God. What, what, uh... It adds some sparkle. Okay. And some fun. And sometimes she'll get a free coffee. I have goddesses... <laughs> wow. Okay, all right. And then she's made his day. She leaves. She has fun. There's a little swing in her step. It's glorious. Yeah. And he's happy, too. Mm -hmm. It's a swing in his step. Mm -hmm. Uh... Mm -hmm. What terms, uh, you know, there, there's this play in New York, the vagina monologues, and yeah. people are talking about that show a lot. What, yeah. what term do you use for down there, that area of a woman? Is there, mm -hmm. is there you know, clinical term? What do you? I, I like to call it a vulva. Right. Because vagina is like the interior part that you Okay, don't use your hands. That's okay. <laughs> you describe and people at home create a mental picture. Back to the vulva. Yeah. There's a, there's a, okay, the vulva is what you use. Yeah, Why? Because it contains all the exterior genitalia, specifically the clitoris, which is a, a, a fantastic organ on a woman's body. It actually contains 8,000 nerve endings. Its sole purpose is pleasure. <laughs> Guys! <laughs> and, you know, guys don't have that. You know, uh, the. We have a pleasure area. No, no, no. <laughs> You? Yes, we do. Darling. Yes, we do. We have 8,000 nerve endings. You have 4,000. Your pleasure area is used, it's a multi-tool. It's used for many what different things. Wait a minute. What do you mean it's a multi-tool? What are you doing in there, Conan? Just cock in the bathroom. <laughs> what do, you have a, what, do you think we have a Phillips head screwdriver attachment? So, like that. It does way more than pleasure. It waxes, it buffs. <laughs> 
It grates cheese. <laughs> but ours is only for fun. Right, right. That's okay. it, babe. Ours is like 99.9% .9 for fun. All right. Uh, you, you, uh, you use arts and crafts. I do. To um, help uh, women discover Inspire. more about themselves. Mm -hmm. um, I'm guessing this is different than the arts and crafts I experienced in fourth grade. I mean, what are we, what are we talking about here? Yes, I would say it's definitely different. Yeah. What I do is I have uh, my sister goddesses, uh, to, they paint their vulvas or we use Play-Doh, uh, glitter glue. But, uh, uh, let's back up the truck just to, for a second. <laughs> you use Play-Doh. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So, you, or construction paper with glitter glue and paint, and the goal is for- Do the Play-Doh people know you're doing this? <laughs> now they do. Now they do. Yes. <laughs> you're getting a letter from the Play-Doh people. I promise you that. Okay, so you, you and, and obviously, I mean, it's no secret, I, I come from a, you know, Irish Catholic family. I'm not, uh, I'm, 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 you know, somewhat repressed. I'm not the most open about my body. How do you help guys like me uh, sort of become a little looser and maybe be able to talk to, you know, your girlfriend or your wife about this kind of thing? Well, how's your sex life? Let's not talk about that. Okay. <laughs> so in your case, I think we'd have to put you in Goddess 101. Maybe we'd call it God 101. Yes, I'm a god. Anyway, uh, and I, I would give you some Play-Doh and have you form your multi-tool. You I hope tool. you have a lot of Play-Doh. <laughs> Good night, America. <laughs> oh my god. You're gonna have to come back because <laughs> we don't have enough time, and I feel like we've just scratched the surface, we have, so to speak. So to speak, yes. Uh, There's much Mama wants to tell you. Yeah, <laughs> that you're a Mama. I am. I'm Mama Gina. Okay. And I'm a real Mama too. I have a yes. daughter. Yes. Okay. I will not call you Mama. That would get confusing and weird. <laughs> um, check out Mama Gina School of Womanly Arts right here in New York City, or look her up on the internet. And you're coming back because we have we have to talk about this stuff. <laughs> All right. Thank you very much, Regina Tomashow, Everyone, we'll take a break. We'll be right back.